Hey guys, it's Hannah. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great week. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I do my everyday makeup routine. Obviously, I don't wear makeup literally every single day, but whenever I do, this is what I've been doing, especially in the summertime. I like to have a very easy, natural, glowy makeup routine that is really quick and easy, and it doesn't make me feel cakey and suffocated in the summer because it's super hot, and I live in Arkansas, so it gets really freaking humid. And I don't like to have a lot of makeup on whenever it's that hot outside. So anyways, I just showed you guys how I got this very natural looking, glowy, easy makeup. If you want to see what I did, just keep on watching. Also, I just want to put a disclaimer right here that I'm not trying to make light of what's going on in our world right now by making this video. I just wanted to spread some positivity and make a fun, lighthearted video for everyone to enjoy. So. I hope you guys like it. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is put on my moisturizer. If you watched my last makeup video, you would have seen me use this. It's the Cetaphil Moisturizing Lotion. Oh, I need to put my hair up. I'm gonna use my Pure Release Eye Serum. Yes, ma'am. So for my foundation, I'm actually going to be using BB Cream. This is the Maybelline Dream BB Fresh in the shade 120 Medium Sheer Tint. I really like this, especially in the summer because it's very light and dewy and looks very natural on my skin, which I like a more natural look in the summer. I don't like to cake on too much makeup. But, ooh, I'm going to take a beauty blender and just take a little bit at a time and blend it into my skin. It's very, very light coverage. So you can kind of tell that it just really evened out my skin tone and kind of made it a more solid shade instead of having my patchiness and the redness and all that. For concealer, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Infallible Full Wear Concealer. So I'm just going to put a tiny, tiny bit under my eyes. Just going to dot it a little. And then I think I'm going to put a little bit on my nose too. Just to add just a little bit of coverage where I have trouble areas. And then I'm going to blend that in. So after I have that concealer blended in, I didn't, as you can see, I didn't put very much on. Just under my eyes to brighten it up a little bit and on my nose because that's where most of my acne is. Now I'm going to set a little bit. I want it to look very dewy, so I'm not going to put too much powder on. I'm just going to set where it's necessary. And for this, I'm using the RCMA No Color Powder. Take a tiny, tiny bit and just set right underneath my eyes. And then I'm also going to lightly set my nose. And then I'm just going to take a big fluffy brush and take the tiniest bit of powder and just all over my, go blah, 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 and just go all over my face. Just, while still trying to keep it dewy. And that's it for the like foundation part of it. Now I'm going to go in with bronzer and I'm not going to try to contour anything. I'm just going to bronze all over my face with the Benefit Hoola bronzer. I'm going to take a huge brush, swirl it in there, and just bronze it up. Next time I'm going to put a little bit of blush on and I'm going to use this really loose fluffy brush so it comes off very natural and not too harsh looking. My natural like redness of my cheeks shows through my BB cream really easy so I don't put too much blush on. Highlighter is a very important part of my everyday makeup routine because I feel like it makes it look very glowy and shiny and I think having a little bit of glow to the skin makes it look a lot more natural rather than it being super cakey and flat and dry. For my highlighter I'm gonna use the Milani highlighter in the shade Strobe Light. This is my favorite highlighter when I don't want anything to like 
Kabam, you know, just something a little bit more light. I'll just put that on my temples, a little bit on my cheeks right here to add some glow. Put that up on my temples, right down the middle of my nose. Cupid's bow. I like it. Okay, so for my eyes, I'm literally just going to use bronzer. It's really easy and quick, and I like doing this because then whenever I'm going somewhere wherever I, or, or whenever I need to do my makeup really, really quick, I don't have to use more product. I can just use something that I already had out. So, and I really love the shade of this Hoola bronzer for my eyelids, and then it just makes all of my face kind of match and blend together. So I just take a big fluffy eyeshadow brush. I swirl it around in there a little bit. And I'm gonna put that on my eyelids. And you can already tell that that really warmed up my eyes and just added some dimension. Then I'm gonna take that same highlighter that I used earlier and just put that on my inner corner of my eyelid. And then I'm gonna put on mascara and that's gonna be it for my eyes. I'm gonna use the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara. Then I'm just gonna brush out my eyebrows a little bit. I'm not gonna fill them in or anything. Keeping it natural. And then the very last step that I'm gonna do for my everyday makeup is put on some Aquaphor. And I love this for the summer because it has SPF 30 in it, especially in the summer to protect your skin from the sun. And also this is, Aquaphor is just very moisturizing. So I like to use it in the summer, especially when my lips get really dry. That is it for today's video. I hope you guys liked it, um, and I hope you guys enjoyed watching me show you how I do my everyday makeup. Um, if you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!